Okay. So we'll be solving the Fibonacci term using the your calculator in putting the formula at once. So let's try the 15th term of the Fibonacci sequence. We should be getting 610. So again, you have to use parentheses so that your calculator would I would follow your or our basic rule. And thus. So we need to open parentheses. 1 plus square root of 5. And then right marks arrow. Close. Divided by 2. And then close. And then raise to whatever the exponent or whatever the end term of the Fibonacci we have 15. And then later on, and then we'll be dividing this by square root of 5. And take note. Kaya nagkaroon tayo ng dalawang parenthesis to is that we need to separate the operation dun sa numerator natin. Para mauna yung addition ni 1 and square root of 5 in our calculator. Okay. And then, the cost natin will give us 600. Okay. Uh, try natin uli yung part by part. So, part by part, 1 plus square root of 5. Equals, we are not concerned with the risk with these results yet. We are concerned with the final result. Divided by 2 is 215 divided by square root of 5. Now, either way will give us the same solution, which is 600. Okay. So that's how we solve for the Fibonacci term using your calculator and using the Binet simplified formula. Any question?